हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टॉपिक ऑफ पावर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स दैट इज डायोड सो लेट अस डिस्कस अबाउट द डायोड्स एंड व्हाट आर द इट्स टाइप्स ऑफ द डायोड्स सो फर्स्ट कम टू द इंट्रोडक्शन पार्ट ऑफ द डायोड्स सो डायोड बेसिकली ए डिफाइंड एज द सेमी कंडक्टर डिवाइस विथ टू टर्मिनल्स दैट कंडक्ट्स करेंट इन वन डायरेक्शन ओनली सो इट इज ए यूनिलेटरल डिवाइस इफ ऑपरेटेड विद इन द स्पेसिफाइड वोल्टेज द नेम इंडिकेट्स डायोड मीन्स इट हैज़ द टू इलेक्ट्रोड्स सो द डिवाइस हैज द टू इलेक्ट्रोड्स दैट इज द एनोड एंड कैथोड यू कैन सी दैट इन द सिम्बोल द डायोड हैज two that is anode that is positive and cathode is negative so you can see in the diagram next come to the topic of working principle of diode so a diode working principle depends upon the interaction of the n type and p type semiconductor an n type semiconductor has plenty of free electrons and very few number of holes so in other words we can say that the concentration of free electron is high and that the holes is very low in n type semiconductor free electrons in the n type semiconductor are referred as majority charge carriers and holes in the n type semiconductor are referred to as the minority charge carriers a p type semiconductor has a very high concentration of holes and low concentration of free electrons holes in the p type semiconductor are majority charge carriers and free electrons in the p type semiconductor are minority charge carriers next come to the topic that is the unbiased diode so in the unbiased diode we can the n type region and the p type region comes in the contacts so what happen we can see that in the unbiased diode when n type and p type are in the contact so how due to here due to the concentration difference the majority carrier diffuse from one side to another as the concentration of hole in the high in p type region and low in the n type region the holes start diffusing from p type region to n type region again the concentration of free electron is high in n type region and low in p type region due to this reason free electrons start diffusing from n type region to the p type region the free electron diffusing in the p type region and the n type region would recombine with holes available there and create uncovered negative ions in the p type region in the same way we can the hole diffusing in n type region from the p type region would recombine with free electrons available there and create uncovered positive ions in the n type region so here you can see that the p type region and n type region so n type region there is hole and in the p uh, <coughs> and sorry in the in the p type region the holes and negative ions is there and the n type region the free electrons is there so again the next topic is the forward biased diode so in the forward biased diode when the positive terminals is that is the p type is connected with the positive terminal and the negative terminal that is n type is connected with the negative terminal of the source so so in this type n type is connected with the negative terminal and if we increase the voltage of the source slowly from zero so in the beginning there is no current flowing through the diode and this is because the external electric field applied across the diode but still majority charge carriers do not get sufficient influence of the external field to cross the depletion region the depletion region acts as the potential barrier against the majority charge carriers and this potential barriers is called the forward potential barrier and the majority of charge carriers 
start crossing the forward potential barrier only when the value of extern externally applied voltage across the junction is more than the potential of the forward barrier. For the silicon, the pot forward potential barrier is 0.7 volt and the germanium is 0.3 volt. When the externally applied voltage, forward voltage across the diode becomes more than the forward barrier potential and the free majority charge carriers start crossing the barrier and contribute the forward diode current. In this situation, the diode would behave as a short circuit path and the forward current gets limited by only the externally connected resistor to the diode. This is the circuit diagram. Here you can see that the positive terminal of the P type is connected with the positive terminal and N type is connected with the negative terminals. So the free electrons is there in N type and the hole is in the P type. Similarly, in the reverse biased, just opposite of forward biased, in forward biased we have to connect with the positive terminal with P type and negative terminal with N type. Here we have connect the terminal P type with the positive terminal of the voltage P type of the here we connect, connect the uh, negative terminal with the P type and positive terminal of the voltage N type of the diode. So the electrostatic attraction of negative potential of the source and the holes of P type region would be shifted more away from the junction leaving more uncovered negative ions at the junction. In the same way the free electrons in the N type region would be shifted more away from the junction towards the positive registered positive terminal of the voltage source leaving more uncovered positive ions in the junction. As a result of this phenomena the depletion region becomes wider and this condition of diode is called the reverse biased condition. At this condition the majority charge carriers cross the junction as they go away from the junction. In this way a diode blocks the flow of current when it is reverse bias. As we already told that the beginning of the article that is when there are always some free electrons in the p-type semiconductor and some holes in n-type semiconductor. These opposite charge carrier semiconductor are called the minority charge carriers. In the reversed biased condition the holes find themselves in the n-type and would easily cross the reverse biased depletion region as the field across the depletion region does not present rather it helps minority carriers to cross the depletion region. As the result, the tiny current flowing through the diode from positive to negative side and the amplitude of this current is very small as the number of minority charge carriers in the diode is very small. This current is called the reverse saturation current. If the reverse voltage across the diode get increased beyond the safe values to highest el electrostatic force and that due to the higher kinetic energy of minority charge carriers colliding, colliding with the atoms and the number of covalent bonds get broken to contribute a huge number of free electrons whole pairs in the diode and process in cumulative. The huge number of such generated charge carriers would contribute a huge reverse current in the diode. If this current is not limited to external resistance connected to the diode circuit, the diode may be permanently be destroyed. Here, this is the diagram. Here you can see that that is the depletion region is wider and in P type is connected with the negative terminal and N type is connected with the positive terminal. This is the types of the diode. First is Zener diode. Second is PN junction diode. Third tunnel diode, fourth varactro diode, fifth scotty diode, sixth photo diode and seventh pin diode, eighth laser diode, avalanche diode, light emitting diode. So this is the types of diode. Next we have to come with the topic of multiple choice question of diode. First question is that 
द रिवर्स करेंट इन द डायोड इज द ऑर्डर ऑफ किलो एम्पेयर मिली एम्पेयर माइक्रो एम्पेयर एम्पेयर सो द सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस दैट इज द माइक्रो एम्पेयर द रिवर्स करेंट डायोड इज द ऑर्डर ऑफ माइक्रो एम्पेयर सेकेंड क्वेश्चन इज दैट द फॉरवर्ड वोल्टेज ड्रॉप अक्रॉस द स्लीकन डायोड इज अबाउट दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट सेवन वोल्ट थर्ड द डायोड फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स इज देयर इज फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज सिंपलेस्ट इन द सेमी कंडक्टर डिवाइस हैज द कैरेक्टरिस्टिक क्लोसिक मैच टू टू द सिंपल स्विच इज द टर्नल डिवाइस टू टर्नल डिवाइस ऑल ऑफ द एव सो आंसर इज दैट ऑल ऑफ द एव नेक्स्ट हाउ मेनी टर्नल डज डायोड हैव सो आई हैव यू ऑलरेडी टोल्ड दैट एट द टर्नल हैज ओनली द टू टू टर्न टू टर्नल हैज ओनली इन डायोड सो दिट इज द मल्टीपल क्वेश्चन दैट इज कमिंग इन पी एस यूज और गेट सो थैंक यू वेरी मच इफ यू हैव लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब दिस वीडियो